Hello guys, welcome you all in a new video and this video is totally dedicated for the consumers who is using Samsung Android smartphone of any series like A series, M series, J series, F series. If any series of Samsung Android smartphone if you're using and if your phone is locked due to forgotten pin pattern and password lock and if you had hard reset of your Samsung Android smartphone then after hard reset when you will switch on your phone you will get a such type of welcome pop-up so you can see here you're getting here welcome pop-up language option start option and emergency call okay now after hard reset when you will go through all the process in your samsung android smartphone let's check what happened here so you will have to follow all the steps go to the agree now here you will have to connect your phone to the wi-fi network and it's mandatory so i am going to connect my phone to the wi-fi network So, uh, I'm going to connect, just a minute, Yeah. So here you can see the phone is connected to the Wi-Fi network then after it will switch to your new page here you will have to wait until it runs to a new page here. So here you can see after hard reset, it's again asking your pin pattern and password lock. But here you can see you're getting an, another option that is showing here, use my Google account instead. So simply you will have to tap on this option to check to the next page here. So here you can see it's asking verifying your account. It means here you will have to feed your Gmail ID and password. If you have your Gmail ID and password, though so you can easily feed your email ID and password and go to the next option. But if you don't have your Gmail ID, you can see here you're not getting any skip option in this space. So here in this video, I will show you how you will get a skip option on this space and this lock is known as FRP lock, which is generated by Google to secure your smartphone your phone is when your phone is stolen. So this video is completely dedicated to uh, give you some tips and tricks to how you can bypass your FRP lock of your Samsung Android smartphone of any series. So make sure watch this video properly till the end then after you will uh, also able to bypass your FRP lock of your Samsung Android smartphone. So firstly you will have to go to the start option at the starting page to the welcome page okay now here you can see you're getting your language option firstly you will have to change your language from English India to English US. <coughs> sorry <coughs> so then after you will have to go to the okay now after that you will have to tap on this start option and go to the agree to all then after go to the agree here 
now you will have to reach to the base that will show here your wi-fi connection okay then after in this base here you will have to activate your phone's talkback option and for this you will have to press the power button and the volume up button you will have to press hold and release then after you will have to tap on this use option now again you will have to repeat the process now here you will have to draw a opposite l like this now you will have to double tap on this while using the app now after that you will have to tap on this use voice command double tap open google assistant open setting now you can see here your phone setting has been appear on your phone display now if you are also getting your phone setting option on your phone page then firstly you will have to switch off your talkback option for this you will have to repeat the process press the power button and the volume up button press hold and release now you can see here the talkback option has been switched off but you can see here you are getting here a logo of lock you can see here some uh, viewers comment that your phone is not locked so you can see here you are getting here lock option it means this phone is locked due to frp lock okay so here uh, we will change some settings to bypass the frp lock firstly you will have to scroll down and you will have to come to the option that will show here lock screen simply you will have to tap on this option now the first option here you will get here the screen lock type when i will tap on this one you can see here a screen lock type is showing swipe so when i will tap on this you can see it's not working so don't worry at all simply you will have to scroll down and you will have to reach to the option that will show here face recognition you will have to tap on this face recognition the first one when when i will tap on this face recognition option it will come on this page you will have to tap on this continue option five time two three four and five then after you have to go to the back option after that you will get an option that will show here about lock screen simply you will have to tap on this lock screen option and you will have to tap on this open source license when you will tap on this open source license you will get a page where you will get a lots of thing on your on a new page but here you will get a url you can see here simply you will have to copy this url from here okay now copy from here and go to the back option again you have to go to the back back and you will have to exit from your setting page okay now after that simply you will have to go to the option that will show here add network option and here you will have to come on the setting page here again now firstly you will have to scroll down and come to the option that will show here reset to default setting simply you have to tap on this and you will have to tap on this reset keyboard setting and reset from here the second option will show here erase personalized prediction you will have to tap on this one and again you will have to erase from this page now go to the back option here now after that you will have to come on this that will show here the option that will show here language and types you will have to tap on this manage input language here you will have to select the english us and uncheck the english india go to the back option back now after that you have to come on this text shortcut now here you will have to tap on this add now here you will have to type that is the star as zero zero star as and here you will have to paste that url that you had copied from setting base now go to the add option go to the back now in this page all the settings has been done simply you have to go to the back option and reach to the starting page here okay now after that you have to tap on this start option agree to all go to the agree now go to the agree now after that you have to tap on this next option so after that you have to select this don't copy So you can see here now you're getting here a skip option now you don't need to remember your Gmail ID and password and your phone number simply you can skip this page from this skip option so you can see here this phone is completely FRP bypass with the help of some setting changes in your Samsung Android smartphone of any series and this process is completely applicable for any model of the Samsung Android smartphone only for Samsung okay now after that simply you have to tap on this skip option now uh, as you know that your frp lock has been bypassed so you can easily set up your phone now it's your final setup of your smartphone so if you wanted to use new pin pattern and password lock so you can use from this space so i will right now use a new pattern lock from here go to the confirm
go to the next skip from here skip this page now you're you're getting a that you're all set up so you simply you will have to tap on this finish option go to the okay agree now select your language continue select your gender your age criteria and finish so here you can see the samsung android smartphone has been completely unlocked so you have you can see here after hard reset you had a stuck in the frp lock so with the help of some setting changes you can also bypass your frp lock from your samsung android smartphone so if this video helped you to bypass your frp lock then do the like this video and if you have stuck anywhere in this video then make us comment our team will definitely respond on your comments so thank you so much see you in your next videos